Madison Square. Ellen DeGeneres is coming back. Hope you join us for that. We got a tiebreaker game now worth two thousand dollars. And Sean, you start it. Howie Mandel, please. All right, Howie. At the end of this, Laertes, Claudius, and Queen Gertrude are all dead. The end of what? Their lives. <laughs> I think that makes sense. I would say that's uh, Joan of Arc. All right. I disagree. Hamlet. It's Hamlet. Okay. Circle gets it. Kim? Kathy Griffin. Kathy. Okay. 70% of Cosmo readers said that they censor themselves when it comes to what? Yelling out another man's name in bed. <laughs> or another woman's. It's a modern time That's we live right. in. Um, let's see, they censor themselves from telling, um, these are women, so I'll say they censor themselves from telling their weight. I agree. Revealing secrets of any kind to their boyfriend. So Circle gets that. Sean? Kennedy for the win. For the win and a quick two grand if you get it. Kennedy, over the years, Lindsay Dole has been stalked by a nun killer, a serial murderer, and a cannibal. Oh. Where will you find Lindsay Dole? In John Grisham novels. I disagree. On the practice. On the practice circle. Gets the square and win. Another $2,000. This next game is worth $4,000. Sean, you start. Howie Mandel. All right, Howie. To William Shatner, what are Preserver, Odyssey, and Avenger? He doesn't name his hair pieces. <laughs> um, I, I think he has race horses. I think he's into the into the horse game. Okay. I think those are the names of his horses. I disagree. Names of Star Trek novels he's co-written. Circle gets the square. Tim. Martin Mull. All right, Martin. How to clean almost everything suggests putting a piece of bread under the broiler in your oven in order to prevent what? Well, family squabbles. Um, so that, like, when you say to your wife, hey, geez, we're out of bread again? And she says, no, there's one under the broiler. So, also ants. <laughs> ants and small, small animals in your oven. Ants. I, I disagree. You're... <laughs> Fires, the bread will absorb the grease in the event of fires. Uh, X gets the square. John? Lorenzo Lamas. Lorenzo Lamas is TV movie. Fires, fires, there's this month. I've got to stand. It's a good thing. It's a good thing that I wasn't called on Monday or Tuesday because I lost my voice. I had oh, God. We've been waiting. But I love you and I'm glad I'm here. <laughs> Lorenzo, what, yes. does he, what does the all-knowing Dr. Joyce Brothers say is the most common reason the modern man is late for a date? Facial hair, it's a thing, you know. Guys, my brothers are out there, they're doing all kinds of things with their face before they leave the house, so I would right. say they Spending spend a lot time? of time trimming their facial okay. hair. Good enough. Um, I disagree. Really? <laughs> he needs to stop at the ATM is why. That's why I certainly don't. Kong, the angry gorilla, is pursued by a stout mustachioed man named what? A stout mustachioed man. <laughs> I know this because it's my name, Mario. I agree. Mario it is. Yeah, you got a block there. All right, Sean. All right, Kennedy for the block. Kennedy for the block. All right, Kennedy. What did Al Gore claim he hold, chopped, shredded, spiked, put in the barn, stripped, and sold? <laughs> Dipper! <laughs> I believe it's that there tobacco. I agree. It is tobacco. All right, Circle gets the block there. Tim. Kathy Griffin for the block. Kathy for the block. All right, Kat. True or false, the head of the Food and Drug Administration has to inspect the presidential birthday cake every year to make sure it's safe. I'm going to say false. I agree. False. Made that up. False. X gets the square, and you got three X's up there, Tim. That means you leave us today with $2,500. But all told, with $35,500. Great X to here. Well, Sean, one, two, three circles. You got $4,500 today so far.
You're going to the finals on Friday, but you know what's more uh, imminent in your future? We're going to play the bonus round for $25,000 in cash this time. Wow.